Travel through the artistic and political twists and turns of 20th century Italy in the new exhibition at Palazzo Strozzi. Dawn of a Nation, from Guttuso to Fontana and Schifano, highlights Italy's astounding creative growth and the development of a sense of nationhood over a 20-year period, beginning in the aftermath of World War II and culminating with the protests of 1968. Over 70 works from this period, which was marked by significant political and artistic change, will be on display. The starting point for the exhibition is the sharp divergence between realism and abstraction, but the narrative weaves its way through many styles, including informal art, the pop period, monochromatic painting, arte povera, and conceptual art. We spoke with the director of Palazzo Strozzi, Arturo Galanzino, and curator of the exhibition, Luca Massimo Barbero, about what audiences can take away from this visually and intellectually striking exhibition, a true time capsule of an interesting period of development in Italy. Yeah, this exhibition is a long journey through two decades of modern art in Italy, after the Second World War until 1968. In this way, we are celebrating the 50th anniversary of this important pivotal year of our history. In the meantime, we are trying to give a sense, an historical sense, of all the transformation in the art world, which are linked to a general transformation in our society, in our economy, in our culture. So we are putting together history and art history in a very original way, with a synthesis telling a story so rich, various and interesting. I think the foreign audience could be <laughs> surprised, positively surprised by this exhibition because normally, generally, we think that the biggest, uh, most important artists of the time were American, especially 50s, 60s, you know. But actually here we discover how Italian art is always avant-garde and uh, if we check today the art price of the market, uh, this is very evident. Artists of the 50s or the 60s nowadays are uh, the most sought and collected uh, by the gota of collectors uh, worldwide. Uh, so the market discovered these artists before the institutions. And now we are trying to give it back, you know, uh, to give back something to our uh, genius of 50s and 60s. So actually there's no conceptual, there's a kind of idea of showing to the people um, room by room what's happening or what happened in Italy from 1958 to 1968. Though we start with the painting of 1955. So history has been changing, post-war had you know brought a lot of very interesting new energies. So each room is um, expressionist it's white, like the one we are in, and then there's red flags, the communists, the fascists, there's still all those fights going on. So Italy re was reborn in a way through his art. So what you're going to see here is the way Italian, the new generation, were looking at Italy with a new idea of freedom.